Hey guys, welcome back to Crafty Q. So I'm back with another Dollar Tree um, party table setting. And today I am doing a unicorn theme. So uh, unicorn theme is very popular. Um, it has been for probably the last year or so. And it still continues on. So I guess the Dollar Tree um, is keeping up with their, their themes. And now they actually have unicorn party supplies in their store so i went and they had all this stuff they even had a little um some other things i didn't pick up because i think i can um, do a table setting with just these few items so let's get started and i'll show you what i did so the very first thing we have are the um what are these the square um pink plates so i know that unicorn theme a lot of people are using like pastel colors so the Dollar Tree items are more um, vibrant color. So I kind of want to just kind of mix it up a little bit. So I mixed the pastel pink um, square plates and then I added the actual Dollar Tree unicorn plates. And then they actually had the cute little matching napkins. I took um, the pink paper cups and just to add a little bit more color, I added the pastel yellow napkins inside. And let's see, a part of the decoration, I added these cute little, I guess they're the um, unicorn cake plates. Yeah, so normally, you know, I guess people will have them to the side or on the cake table. But I think um, by adding them actual to the actual table, it kind of adds a little bit more to the table. Um, me personally, I don't like a table that's kind of empty. I kind of like to fill it up a bit. And just by adding the cake plates, um, to the table it's actually pretty cute i think um people can actually uh, maybe you can act, um, have a little goodies on the actual cake plates maybe you can have a cupcake there you know your choice or you could just leave it blank or uh, empty as i have it right here because it is so cute <laughs> so um, next we are moving to the centerpieces which are um these paper napkins that i just kind of crumbled up and put inside the Dollar Tree jars and I added my little gold bling you know what unicorn party do you have that doesn't have a little bit of bling and so that's what's in there and you guys I was like I'm going to try something new so um, I went and took the same paper plate that you see here and attached it to a stick and made a centerpiece how cute is this so this was pretty easy to make. Um, you can actually just hot glue a stick to the back of the plate or you can um, double side, use double sided tape. Or because I just added to the back of this one, if you want to make them double sided so that your guests aren't just looking at a, a, a paper plate with a stick attached, you can actually put two paper plates together um, back to back with the stick in the middle and then maybe garnish it with um, some ribbon in between or maybe some, um, the same like tissue paper and kind of shred it around there you know you guys just have to be creative and let's see what else so this inner piece I actually took a, a well because it's um, almost Easter uh, the Dollar Tree has these um, Easter I guess little buckets so I got the pink ones and then I just took the Dollar Tree um, unicorn centerpiece that they had that that matches everything else and I just set it on top um, just to give it a little bit height, you know, to make it kind of work with the other two centerpieces. So there you have it. I think this came out really cute and I'm loving this whole paper plate centerpiece idea. I think I'm going to have to um, use it a bit more and see what I can come up with and see how, um, you know, I can start adding these to more of my table decorations. And then um, lastly, I have, well, not lastly, actually, I forgot to show you. I'm using the pink plastic tablecloth. See, you guys didn't even pay attention that it was plastic because the table is so full of other things that kind of take your mind away from that. It's actually a plastic tablecloth from the Dollar Tree. And then we have the backdrop, which I love adding backdrops. Um, and this very cheap backdrop <laughs> is made of paper napkins. Just to stay within the same color scheme, I use um, the pastel yellow, the pastel pink, and then the same matching napkins um, to match the unicorn theme. 
I just um, added that to the string as well. So the napkins are just folded over the string and then the other paper napkins, you can actually punch a hole through them and string them, but uh, yeah, I didn't have time for that. So what I did was actually just um, got some really strong tape and just rolled it around and taped the napkin to the actual string. But if you want something a little bit more sturdy, I suggest maybe even hot gluing the napkins to the string. Um, what else? And I just did this, but I mean, you can come up with all kinds of variations. You can, um, I just wanted to add a bit more color, but you can actually just do all the unicorn napkins for your backdrop. And this is great uh, behind like your cake table, your dessert table, or even to have your guests stand in front of to take pictures. You can add rows of this because you get so many napkins in the pack. I mean, you could really fill a wall up. So I think I covered everything. I hope you guys enjoy watching my um, Dollar Tree table setting. And I'm going to see if I can come up with some more items, especially using these uh, paper plates for centerpieces. Because centerpieces can actually cost you a lot. I mean, if you're getting, you know, ones made. But if you're trying to do all Dollar Tree items and you want to kind of jazz things up a bit, there you go. All right, guys, so I'll talk to you later. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more of my videos like this. And don't forget to hit that bell notification so you really don't miss any of my upcoming um, videos. I'll talk to you guys later. Take care.